More than a week after Hurricane Milton hit southwest Florida with strong winds and a powerful storm surge, trees and plants across the region are turning brown. I'm your community correspondent, Mahmoud Bennett, and experts tell me why this is happening. After Hurricane Milton swept through southwest Florida, you probably started noticing something strange. That they turn brown quick. Brown and then they look like they're just drying up. Trees and plants turning brown across the region, from Charlotte County to the Barrier Islands. This is what people are seeing all around. All these things are stresses, and just like us, plants don't like stress. Ralph Mitchell is the head of the Charlotte County Horticulture Program. I asked him how Hurricane Milton is impacting plant life. So Milton had high velocity winds, and what you're seeing primarily is uh, a leaf scorch from the high winds where the moisture is actually blown out of the leaf causing that desiccation. Now some of it there may be in some places uh, aerosolized salt and also particulate matter that did some abrasion but for the most part if you look around you see the the high wind velocity damage. Mitchell says the brown color doesn't necessarily mean the trees are dying. In time he says many of them will recover. The good news is although it looks horrendous just like Ian, if you remember Ian, it blew all the leaves off, but within weeks or a month or so, it started all coming back. So we had almost like a weird early spring. The same's gonna happen with this. You'll see more brown leaves, they'll drop, and we should have some good um, uh, leafing back in maybe a month or so. In the meantime, if you notice salt damage, Mitchell recommends flushing the soil with fresh water. If you live in a coastal area, consider planting salt tolerant species. As for the brown plants along the street, he says with a little time, they'll bounce back on their own. So I think this is a, not a good look right now, but that be encouraged that we will have a, a, a greener future. Reporting in Charlotte County, Mahmoud Bennett, Fox 4 News.